Hello, my name is Mr. Willems and I'll be showing you how to use your Microsoft Ink tools to be able to um, do our Cornell notes that we use in this class in a digital format. What you're gonna need to do is open up a Google Doc or any other device or any other program that you need to use to that you're gonna copy your drawings into. And then you're gonna click down here where it has the little Microsoft Ink workspace and click it and select the sketch pad. When that opens up, you're given a, a blank canvas. And what you can do is you see several options up here. And I, I would recommend that you uh, enable the touch writing, which I'm gonna do right now. And then I recommend that you also use the pen, which allows uh, a little finer definition with the color and choose a size somewhere between six and three for definition. I'm gonna choose three today. And then you just use your finger to scribe and draw on your screen what it is you need to take notes over. Like for instance, in our first set of notes, you can be taking notes over accuracy and precision. So you'd write the word accuracy and I'm using my finger to do that. And then you're gonna have the definition. Then you're gonna have some diagram. So let's imagine I have a ruler and I have several lines and a ruler with several lines and I'm gonna have accuracy and I have a label because diagrams are labeled pictures with an explanation. Now you're not going to just write definition, label and explanation, but you're actually gonna write those things in. And when you're finished with um, taking the Cornell notes over each concept by having a labeled diagram over each concept for this course, then for each concept, you can go over to the menu here where it says copy and click that. And then you can, once it's copied, you can toggle over to the window that you want to copy it into. I'm gonna use Alt tab, which is gonna allow me to go between the sketchpad window and the window I want to copy to like this. And I'm gonna select the window I want and then I'm gonna click into that window and where my cursor is, I'm gonna right click and it's gonna paste. And that's the picture that I just made in Sketchpad. I'm also gonna show you how you can crop it so it's a little tighter. So you go up here next to where image options is and you click crop image and then you can drag the corner in and the side in and the bottom up. And when you click off of the cropped image, it now has that size. And once you're ready to go onto the next concept, you make sure your cursor's located after the image that you've inserted and hit enter twice, which gives you some space. And then you can open Sketchpad again by clicking here, going back to Sketchpad. And if you'd like to, you can save what you've made as in its own image, or you can simply clear it and keep going because your image should be saved in your digital notes. If you have any questions, it wouldn't hurt to reach out to your instructor. I hope you have a fantastic day and make a positive difference in somebody's life.